How you doing? My name is Bill Pacone, born and raised in Brooklyn, New York, and I am now a proud owner of the finest truck, flatbed roll-off made, Detroit Wreckers Low Loader. This is my 2013 Ford 750 XLT with a 21 foot low loader and wheel lift. And this truck is built to work. I traveled 1,400 miles to buy this truck just because of the work and the design that they do. And I absolutely couldn't be happier. And everything you see outside of the cab and chassis is hand built at Detroit Wrecker. And this is it. I like this. This is the bed height right here. Most flatbeds are here. Any high-end exotic sport car or piece of equipment with a very low profile rubber tire such as any electric scissor jack or forklift, drive them up and down all day long, not hitting no chin spoilers, and the little electric rubber tires can't drive up the steep bed. I live currently in Fort Lauderdale, Florida, which is exactly 1,400 miles south of here. I put my order in a couple of months ago, I had the truck delivered brand new from a local dealership, VIP truck sale, and brand new blank page, Detroit Wrecker built the whole truck. Traveling 1,400 miles doesn't mean anything to me. I'm just happy there was a, a place to travel to to get a truck that could be built to my liking and to the standards that I expect. Are you worried about warranty issues and other things of that nature because you're so far? No. Does the quality of the craftsmanship here subdue that? Being somebody's a little bit further away, as long as the build is right, I'm not concerned where they where they are because when you leave here you're shown how to maintain the truck and as long as you do that you really shouldn't have any problems but I'm not worried at all that they're 1400 miles away uh, for the most part as long as you don't do anything stupid there really isn't anything to have a problem with and I trusted their expertise and the way that they build to put it on top of a brand spanking new 2013 truck. This truck had zero miles on it, came right here to be built. So if I was nervous, I would have sent them a used truck, but I was already rather confident in what it is that they do from speaking with them for quite a while before I placed my order. How strong do you think this is in comparison to the other units? Well, I think it's a lot stronger because you're able to control the weight distribution as you bring a load back onto the truck. Being you lay the bed out on steel wheels in the back, you could leave most of the weight on the ground until you weigh up to the center point, which you can't do on a regular bed. You also have an extremely high dump angle. The same angle that you see the subframe lifted up on, if the bed was run all the way to the top, you have this massive 38 degree dump angle, which there isn't anything you couldn't slide off your bed. It doesn't matter what it is. Piece of paper, car upside down, load of sand, doesn't matter. Very happy with uh, my build. Mainly high-end exotic sport cars. The low load angle is definitely the key feature for me. The way my truck is, the GVW 33,000, and the way it is built, I have room to put 15,000 pounds on here, which I could load comfortably from the low angle or any angle I choose. But uh, this is every bit of a 20,000 pound plus deck. This is every bit of a 20,000 pound plus deck which I would never, I can't even put the weight on the truck that the build could hold. Can't even put the weight on the truck that the build could hold. But I have forklifts, a lot of uh, bobcats all the way up to the 8, 10, and 12 series that I could drive up and down on here all day long. Also, 
I have a few limousine customers which have regular limo and stretch limo. Stretch limo is 20 feet from wheel to wheel in the center. This bed features no bed locks, as you can see up the subframe. There's no bed locks on a conventional flatbed. If I put a limousine on here with the front wheels up to here and the nose is sticking over this far, I could just bring the bed that shy behind the pylon and I could put a full size stretch limousine up there, which is 20 feet from wheel to wheel on center. These are all the reasons why I travel 1,400 miles. And they buy you free lunch when you buy a $95,000 truck. I'm done. <laughs>